Hello Naomi. I just wanted to let you know that I'm sorry the way my 10 friends and I had to cut ties with you and your midnight meep screw. We cheer girls all have to listen to you in the first place. Anyways, do you have any news to tell me? Oh Melody. I'm really sorry for what I have done as well. And I also accept yours, along with the sweet girl's apologies. I have really bad news to tell you. Oh no. What is it? Well, I'm so scared to tell you Melody, right after my family disowned me, they were assassinated by the sock puppet cheer girls. Oh my god. I'm really sorry Naomi about your mom and dad's death. Will you want to be my adoptive sister and can my friends and I make you a 12th member of the cheer girls? Melody, you just made my day. Yes, I would like to be your adoptive sister and also be a part of the cheer girls as the 12th member. Don't worry. I'll tell Sashar, Eloise, Rebecca and Emma Ravity who are also going to be the 13th, 14th, 15th and 16th members of the cheer girls respectively. I will bail you out of jail and tell mom about what happened. Thank you for telling me about your bad news. Goodbye. Melody Amble, why are you so sad? Well, Naomi just called me from her prison cell, and she told me about the bad news of her family right after they disowned her for good. What happened Melody sweetie? Her family was assassinated. I am beyond miserable for the reason why her parents treated her badly. Not to mention that I apologized to her in advance for what happened, and she did the same thing to me and my cheer friends as well. I even heard that Naomi was trying to threaten and attack the Anderson family back in 2018, which is so saddening to me and my autism. Naomi is so going to get it huge time when I ground her for the rest of her life because she not only abused Waffles and Emmy and harassed so many people for the fun, but she is also going to get it for attempted murder as well. We're all glad that's over with all of the things Naomi has done. Don't worry Melody, you are not in trouble, but Naomi will be in a heap of trouble. We'll bail her out of jail and tell her how much she will be in very deep trouble for all of this. In that case? Let's bail her out of jail and make her a 12th member of the cheer girls. Sachar, Eloise, Rebecca and Emma Ravity are also going to be new members of the cheer girls as well. Naomi, you have some visitors who wants to see you and to bail you out. Hey, I used to like you Melody Amble, but not anymore when I cut ties with you and the rest of your cheer friends. And why are you and your mom furious at me? Did I do something bad? We'll tell you why we're really furious with you. You and the rest of your meeps got arrested for abusing Waffles and Emmy and for harassing so many people for the fun. In addition to that, you got arrested for attempted murder of the Anderson family back in 2018. I mean, what on earth is wrong with you right now? You are almost an adult for crying out loud. I mean... Melody just told me about the dark story about you and your crew. It's time for your beating from Melody Amble, not to mention that she's autism. Well well well, my autism says that you are in very deep trouble. For everything that you have done Naomi, you are grounded for the rest of your life. When we get home, Melody and I will send you to your new room, and as a punishment, you will become a new member of the cheer girls along with Eloise, Rebecca, Saoirse, and Amoravity. Wait Melody. Did I forgot to mention that I also have autism like you? Have a great day. Ladies, I heard that Naomi, Daisy, Sarah, Katie, Lily, Sam, Cecilia, Diego and William got arrested for abusing Waffles and Emmy. And speaking at Naomi, she also got arrested for attempted murder which is not good. The reason I had to put the sign is that she needs to be a part of the cheer girls. Sishaya, Amaravati, Rebecca and Eloise, welcome to the cheer club by the way. Melody Angle and her mom just bailed Naomi out of jail because Naomi's ex-parents treated her very poorly and got sued for it. It's a good thing that we put up the sign for her. But on the other hand, we also have to agree on what we heard as well. 
Naomi needs to improve her behavior, just like us. We're glad she got grounded by her adoptive mother and sister. We all have to agree with you, Ichika. I mean, I cannot believe Naomi has autism for doing something worse like this, just like Melody Amble has autism as an excuse. Once Naomi and Melody Amble get to our apartment, we'll ground her, and have her improve her behavior for what she has done. But let's just say that she has autism. I know right ladies. Melody Amble was the first autistic person to join in the cheer girls, and now I got a feeling that we might have a second autistic person to join in the cheer girls, and I believe her name is Naomi. And let's not to mention that she and the Midnight Meeps turned against all 11 of us back on April 2nd, 2022, and look where it has gotten her and her nine friends into right now. They got in trouble, huge time. And I'm so glad that Waffles and Emmy have started a new life and they are improving their behavior as of right now and beyond. Maybe she could be the third richest girl in town and the second girl to have autism just like Melody Amble, in which I was thinking that she needs to do community service in order for her to do that, which will happen until November 6th of this year. You're not wrong there Crystal. Sometimes she needs to learn a valuable lesson for what she did. I know right says. The Molly gang are all improving behaviors and they are good. Now we all are improving our behaviors just like them, and pretty soon, Naomi will be a part of us Trier girls no matter what so that she can improve her behavior, just like all of us Trier girls and the Molly gang. Come to think of it, all of our moms and dads say that it's about time to improve our behaviors just like the Molly gang did. And Liana, speaking of Naomi, community service is right around her after all of the things she has done to everyone, including all of us cheer girls. And ladies, it's about time Naomi has learned her lesson and will be serving community service for all of the things she has done. Eloise, Victoria and I set up the punishments for her, and in a few minutes, we are ready for her to become a cheer girl member. Yeah. I have to agree with you on that one Rebecca and Maria. Melody is the first person to have autism as an excuse, and now Naomi is the second person to have autism as well. Come to think of it, Naomi got what she wanted the most. I'm glad that was over with the deal and Liana, would you mind stepping back so that we'll prepare the punishments for Naomi? You know something says Shia, I will. Thanks for reminding me about it. As soon as Naomi and Melody get to our apartment, we all are ready for Naomi. She's almost an adult, and we should accept her as the third richest girl and the second girl to have autism. Hi girls. My mom and I brought my adoptive sister Naomi so that she could take action as the new member of the cheer girls. And Rebecca, Amaravati, Seat Shai and Eloise, welcome to the cheer club. Thank you Melody for having us. And Naomi, my autism says that words cannot even begin to describe how crossed we are with you about your behavior towards us last April and back in 2018 as of right now for what you have done. My autism, my friends, my parents and I cannot believe you, Sarah, Digo, Katie, Daisy, Lily, Sam, Cecilia, Larry and William all had the damn audacity to harass so many people for the fun abused Waffles and Emmy and got arrested for these acts. Plus, my autism and I can't believe you got arrested for attempted murder and had your old parents disowned you when they found out everything you have done. Here's all of the punishments that we all are giving you right now. Your first punishment is that you will have to serve community service for everything you have done to all of us. Your second punishment is that you need to improve your behavior for what you have done. Your third punishment is that you will be a part of the cheer girls so that you will not cause any trouble anymore. We heard that you have autism, so your fourth punishment is that you need to see special therapists to make you a better person like us and the Molly gang. Your fifth punishment is that you will have to apologize to Waffles and Emmy for what you have done to them, and also, you need to apologize to other people for what you have done to them as well. And speaking of cutting ties, your sixth punishment is that you will have to start cutting ties with Jennifer, Rachel, Angela, Diego, Sarah, Katie, Daisy, Cecilia, Larry, William, Daisy and Lily. Your seventh punishment is that you will have to give Tayshawn and Keisha a taste of their own medicine and cut ties with them for good. 
Your eighth punishment is that you will be having homework from your teachers at your school that you missed and that you will be expelled from your school severely. Your ninth punishment is that you will be shamed on social medias. Your tenth punishment is that you will have to eat normally at restaurants and take the dress code in public seriously. Your eleventh punishment is that you need to take classes with the Molly Gang every day and night at school. Your twelfth punishment is that you need to become the richest girl by taking responsibilities for your actions. Your thirteenth punishment is that you need to straighten up yourself for what you have done so that you will not go down the same path anymore. Your fourteenth punishment is that you will be having coal on Christmas days and you will be having just desserts for the rest of your life. Your fifteenth and last punishment is that you will have to stay away from the midnight meeps forever and have you pass through security every single day. And if you don't do all of the fifteen punishments that we give you, you will be sent to your chair jail and room for the rest of your life and you will not be able to escape from it, ever. And your sixteenth punishment, let's not forget it, is that you will bid the midnight meeps farewell for good. And with that under the way, those are the sixteenth punishments that the cheer girls and I gave you. Now, is there anything to say for yourself before the punishments take place for you? Mom, Melody, Sakura, Liana, Yui, Maria, Crystal, Penelope, Ariana, Ichika, Victoria, Cecile, Eloise, Rebecca, Sirsha and Amaravati. I'm so sorry the way that I behaved all of these years. I became a horrible monster and I didn't even mean to do those acts at once. I have autism now, and I could not control my emotions. I'm so sorry for everything I have done. I promise that I will be a better and a good girl. Your apology is accepted, but we are still very mad at you for what you have done to everyone and to us like that. But of course, welcome to the cheer club. And Naomi, as an adoptive sister with autism, my autism, my mom, my friends and I will have to say, you are grounded for the rest of your life. Tomorrow, your punishments will take place for what you have done to everyone. Now we will show you your new room so that you will have to remember where it is. And to remember our name, my name is Sue Amble and I am going to be your adoptive mother, Frederick Amble is my husband, and he will also be your adoptive father, and Melody Abel is my daughter and she will be your adoptive sister. And before we send you to your new room, who was the one who is responsible for killing your old family? Well, I hate to say this but, I found out who killed my old family are the sock puppet cheer girls. Oh my freaking god. I can't believe that psychopath was the one who was behind of your old family. That is so it. We are totally cutting ties with that bastard sock puppet version of Melody Amble and her sock puppet friends as of right now. We've also heard about the dark story of the sock puppet cheer girls, so that is why we are absolutely cutting ties with them forever. In that case, I'm beginning to hate the sock puppet cheer girls as of right now. And on top of it, I'm going to start liking all 15 of you cheer girls. That's a great and powerful idea. Melody and her 14 friends love that a lot, and on top of it, you are now ungrounded for the rest of your life. Sog Puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura, Crystal and Yui, the eight of you get your damn asses over here right now. Wait next Sog Puppets Ishaya, Melody, Maria, Liana, Eloise, Naomi, Rebecca and Amravati. Sog Puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura, Crystal, and Yui, we've just heard about the true colors about the eight of you. We can't believe the eight of you along with sock puppets Sirsha, Melody, Maria, Liana, Naomi, Eloise, Rebecca and Amaravati had the damn audacity to attack so many people and victims and went out on a crime spree along with your sock puppet friends to cause victims including Naomi's old family to be killed. But cheer girls and Sue Amble, we are so sorry for what we have done. Your apologies will not cut it this time anymore. As of today and beyond, the eight of you, along with sock puppets Sesh R, Melody Amble, Maria, Liana, Eloise, Naomi, Rebecca and Emma Ravity, will all have to take Naomi's 16 punishments for what you have done. And besides, she has autism like me and you sock puppets will need to accept her for all of this, that's what my autism says to the eight of you. 
And my autism says that we are not only cutting ties to the eight of you, but we are also cutting ties to the Midnight Meeps, the Sock Puppets Sirsha, Melody Amble, Maria, Liana, Eloise, Rebecca, and Amiravati, and pretty soon, the cheer girls will take the Meeps place, and we will have all the fun without the Midnight Meeps and replace them with the Cultural Squad, the Tyler Crew and the Molly Crew. That is why I will have to improve my behavior along with the cheer girls, the Molly crew and other groups and great people Same that I with my autism and or beyond. Of you. As for you sock puppet Penelope, there are no words to say how I'm outraged to say that you and your friends started to become entitled Karens and Mary Sues, because you are grounded for the rest of your life. And sock puppet Victoria, you are grounded for 15 months for attacking people and for making us betray the midnight leaps which have ended last month. And Sock Puppet Crystal, Sock Puppet Cecile, Sock Puppet Ariana, Sock Puppet Sakura, Sock Puppet Yui and Sock Puppet Ichika, all six of you are grounded for six months. Now, all eight of you get out of our sights and go to your rooms right now because the punishments are coming for the eight of you. How could all 16 of you betray us for no goddamn reason? Sock puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sura, Crystal, and Yui, all eight of you shut up and go to your rooms right now. Sock puppets Sirsha, Melody Amble, Maria, Liana, Eloise, Naomi, Rebecca and Amaravati, the eight of you ladies are next. All eight of you aren't off the hook either. What is it now shit girls and Sue Amble? Are we in deep trouble? Yes all eight of you. We're afraid that this is happening so. Sock puppets Sirsha, Melody, Maria, Liana, Naomi, Eloise, Rebecca and Amoravati, we've just heard about the true colors about the eight of you as well. We can't believe the eight of you along with sock puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura. Crystal and Yui had the damn audacity to attack so many people and victims and went out on a crime spree along with your sock puppet friends to cause home invasions and did a few other crimes like getting involved with murder. I mean, have the eight of you and sock puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura, Crystal and Yui all lost your minds right now? Don't even tell because all 16 of you have. We're so sorry cheer girls and so amble for what we have done to Naomi's old family. We never expected to go on a crime spree, but that was just awful of us. Your apologies will not cut it this time anymore. As of today and beyond, the eight of you, along with sock puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura, Crystal, and Yui, will all have to take my 16 punishments for what you have done. And besides, I have autism like Melody Amble and you sock puppets will need to accept me for all of this, that's what my autism says to the eight of you. And my autism says that we are not only cutting ties to the eight of you, but we are also cutting ties to the Midnight Meeps, sock puppets Penelope, Ariana, Victoria, Ichika, Sakura, Crystal and Yuri, and pretty soon, the cheer girls will take the Meeps place. And we will have all the fun without the Midnight Meeps and replace them with the Cultural Squad, the Tyler Crew and the Molly Crew. That is why I will have to improve my behavior along with the Cheer Girls, the Molly Crew and other groups and great people that I love nowadays and beyond. As for you Sock Puppet Amravati, there are no words to say how I'm outraged to say that you and your friends started to become entitled Karens and Mary Seuss because you are grounded for the rest of your life. And Sock Puppet Melody Amble, you are grounded for the rest of your life for getting involved with home invasions and did a few other crimes. As for you Sock Puppet Searsha, you are grounded for the rest of your life for sexually assaulting victims and dousing them and burning their bodies on fire. As for you Sock Puppet Maria, you are grounded for six months for dismembering the victim's body with a saw and another one with an electric saw. And Sock Puppet Naomi, Sock Puppet Liana, Sock Puppet Eloise and Sock Puppet Rebecca, all four of you are grounded for five months for getting involved with murder. Now, all eight of you get out of our sights and go to your rooms right now because the punishments are coming for the eight of you. Yeah. I can't believe those 16 Sock Puppets were those ones behind all of this. We totally agree with you Liana. When will these sock puppets ever learn not to do bad stuff like this?
Can't they just straighten up themselves for once?